Hello, my name is Gregory Wilson, and I'm here to brag about a brand new trick by Brian Gillis called the Peak Pack. So it's new to you. It's old to him since it's been a signature piece in his repertoire for at least the last 25 years, and I've seen him perform this everywhere. In fact, every single room here at the Magic Castle, close up, stand up, I've seen him perform it in the ladies' room, and it kills. That said, it's easy to do. Slight free, right out of the box, practically self-working. And the reason I want to share this with you, this fools laymen, it fools magicians. It's super fun to watch. I'm super excited to share this with you. He's jealously guarded this. It took a while to drag this out of him. And you can thank me later. You guys all ready? Yeah. yeah. Card trick. Now it's important you realize that I uh, wouldn't use trick cards. Only amateurs would use trick cards. I'm going to flash through the card. What's your name? Chris. Chris. I'll flash through the cards as they go by. You look at them and pick a card in your mind. Don't pick the end card, but you have to see it. You understand? All right. Did you okay. pick one out? Yep. Not the end card. Nope. Um, <laughs> Nicole. Nicole. Yep. As they go by, pick one in your mind. Did you pick Got one it. out? Uh, no, one more time. Yes. Not the end card. Nope. Okay. But anyway, uh, Dorian? Yeah. Did you pick one out? It was too fast. I hate women say that. Too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Not the end card. No. All right, the reason I emphasize you actually have to see a card is because sometimes people don't follow directions. For instance, if I do this for kids, a lot of times kids will just invent a card. They don't actually see one. A lot of, uh, occasionally, kids will purposely try to mess up the magician. I, I hate kids. Uh, <laughs> What's your name? Sandy. Sandy, as they go by, pick one in your mind. Did you pick one out? Yes. Not the end card. Uh, your name? Kim. Kim? Did you pick one out? Yes. A and uh, Courtney? Yes. Did you see a card? Not the end card. Not the end card. All right. This is not a matter of physically taking a card out of the deck, putting it back in the deck, controlling the cards, and then pr producing the selected card. Nobody touched the cards. Everybody arbitrarily thought of a card as being flashed. Concentrate on the value of the card. Uh, whether it's higher or lower than a seven. Are you doing this? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yours was lower than a seven? Yes. It was a six? Yes. A red six? Yes. Not a heart? Nope. Six of diamonds? Yep. Yours was a four? Yes. Four of clubs? Yes. <laughs> wow. You had an eight? Eight of clubs? Yes. <laughs> Yours was a... Uh, Five? Yes. Five of hearts? Yes. <laughs> you had a jack? Yeah. Jack of spades? Yeah. <laughs> Yours was a king? Yeah. King of diamonds? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! It was crazy! It, it was, was amazing. Amazing. Oh, Mind boggling. Yeah. 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 Shocked. 